<laughs> and I've not fallen off for ages. <laughs> Welcome back to the vlog, it's Tuesday and first swift session for probably two months. It's uh, ramps today, so starting off at around 200 watts and then building for the first set to 275 and then a five minute recovery and then building from 200 watts up to 315. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting to see how I get on. Um, so I'm about, eh, about 10 minutes in and it's not going to be well because these are my physique R1 knits and they really are a thing of beauty but I cannot get the left foot comfortable I cannot get the clean in the right place I've got a pair of S works that have been really quite ratty that I don't want to use those physiques because they're lovely, they're really, really nice, but I cannot get them bloody comfortable. Anyway, I'll uh, check in at the end of this workout. Oh man, I've had to, I've had to pull stamps in 50 minutes. I've got a cramp in my right thigh and uh, it was hurting from the last, last kind of effort, so I was kind of pausing and stretching it, but Oh, it's really sore, so <laughs> that's a hard session. That probably kicked my butt today. Uh, right, anyway, next thing's a run, transition run, and uh, I'll see you on the road. Good evening, it's Wednesday, and a social mountain bike ride tonight. <clears throat> I'm looking forward to it, although I reckon the uh, wood's going to be quite interesting because yesterday we had like 50 60 mile an hour winds there's a lot of trees down so i think the the trails may be blocked in places not that i'm gonna be fast enough to uh suddenly come upon something of course anyway uh yeah not much we'll say really we'll see how it goes i'll show you some of the some of the trails that you normally see from a runner's perspective from the bike tonight hopefully it'll be good should be a good group out as well which is gonna be awesome lots of uh Lots of Mickey taking, I'm sure. We'll see. Probably I'll be the butt of most of it. Here we go. Let's see if I could not crash tonight. Again. Nice and steep. Uh. Oh, the bridge. So there we go, back home. Uh, an hour and a quarter out on the ride, on the ride um, 8.6 miles I think in total, just over 1,700 feet of elevation um, and 1,600 feet of descent. So nice climbing ride. I love it up there because it's really quite tough. You, you kind of get your money's worth uh, and it's good for your legs. So bike's looking not too bad. I need to give it a clean tonight, it's minging. Um, I need to have a look at the gears as well because they're star jumping tonight. I think it's probably just because new cables and stuff. This is the um, the light that I was saying about uh, the other day. It's an exposure six pack. It's their Mark 10. So this has got um, 5,000 lumen on full. And I'll show you. There you go. Even uh, even though it's still light, it's it's ridiculously bright. And there's a couple of different settings so uh, you can control how how long it lasts. Anyway, that's it. That's that's the ride tonight. A couple of crashes, nothing serious. I've got a bit of a, a bit of a bruise on the shin, but uh, you know, nothing too bad. Right, I'll see you tomorrow for, for another workout. I can't remember what that is. 
I'll find out in a minute. <laughs> Good evening, it's Thursday and it's an hour and 20 zone two run tonight. Um, gotta be honest, the first two miles were horrible. I had to uh, kind of dig in and do those first 15, say, 15, 16 minutes was, was tough. But then the last three have been really good. I've been really enjoying it. And uh, <clears throat> seemingly finding like a 6, 6.35, 6.40 pace, pretty comfortable. However, <sighs> that's quite deep. A van's just come through here and it is really quite deep. So my feet are gonna get soggy because there isn't a way through that I can think of. <sighs> last five miles with wet feet, that's gonna be miserable, isn't it? Right. If I'm going to do it, I'm going to get video evidence. I bet a vehicle comes as well. Oh, it's actually not too bad. Yeah. Yeah, my feet are wet. <laughs> oh. <sighs> you. My feet are soaked, and that's minging water as well, isn't it? <laughs> right, I'm going to finish this run off. At the end of it, last 10 minutes, I've got strides to do. So uh, I'll catch up with you after I've done a few of those. Okay, there we go, workout complete. 8.2, 8.3 miles, uh, an hour and 12, just under the kind of workout schedule, but I'm actually feeling pretty under fueled. I'm feeling a bit, a bit shaky. So rather than go on, I thought I'd cut it short and uh, get back and get some food in me. Welcome to Saturday and I'm going to have to keep this very short because I've uh, had to throw in tomorrow's workout today. Uh, now, we've decided very late, very, very late last minute that we're going to go away. It's bank holiday uh, weekend in here in, in the UK. We decided we're going to go away for a couple of nights, take the kids away, just let them have a bit of a holiday as a kind of reward for the, for the rubbish they've had to put up with during, during the last six months or so. So tomorrow's session was meant to be three hours on the bike uh, with 30 minute warm up, four times 20 minutes in zone four power with 10 minutes recovery in between and a 30 minute cool down. I've taken the bulk of that, so I've taken the body of the workout the four times 20 minutes and I've basically condensed the rest of the workout into two hours. So I've got four times 20 minute at zone four, uh, which I've put in for around about 260. I've got a nine minute recovery in between and I've got a five minute warm up. I'm probably gonna have to lose the run as well because we've got loads to do because we wanna get ready to go. <laughs> so I'm being incredibly selfish by getting this workout in as it is. Um, so anyway, right, that's it. I'm gonna crack on and I'll come back when I'm a little bit less eye on the clock and let you know just how miserable I'm feeling. Okay, I'm uh just in the third recovery. So I've done three times 20 at 255, 260 watts. It's hard. <laughs> um, there's the carnage so far. I've gone through a bottle and a, bottle and a bit and two gels. Uh, uh, so in kind of positive news, I've uh, had another play with my physique knits this week and I've finally managed to get the cleat position spot on. They feel really comfortable now, which they haven't done. So um, I'm looking forward to wearing these a lot more. They're a lovely shoe. They're really stiff as well. So yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna uh, finish off this rest. Then I will come back at the end and uh, We'll see. That might be the end of the video, to be honest, at the end of this workout. Um, I might take the camera with me to, uh, to Wales. I'm not sure, because uh, obviously I'm not going for like training and stuff, so I probably won't get a run or anything, but anyway, I will come back at the end of this workout and let you know how I've got on. Oh dear Lord. <laughs> I just finished, I'm on the cool down. That was hard, that was a tough, there you go, focus. That was a tough session. Those 20 minutes were just, <laughs> they were hard. I had to stop a couple of times, uh, had a few family interruptions. So, <laughs> I'm going to be too fussed with that. I did the work, got the time in. So, wow, wow. Right, that's it. So I'll chuck 
data up on screen there somewhere. Yeah, anyway, um, so that's it. That's it for this week. I want to say uh, a massive thank you to everyone that commented on my last video. Um, thanks for all the new subs as well. I hope that uh, hope you find the channel interesting and you stay around. Uh, and I want to also say a massive thank you to Mark Frost for the shout out in his video. And I'm going to link it again to his channel down below because I did a very selfish, selfish video on the uh, FCC Cotswolds ride. And uh, oh, Mark did a brilliant one, so I'm going to link to his channel. Right, that's it. Have a great week. I'm looking forward to this one. We've got a couple of days away, as I said, which is going to be awesome. And we're back into training. Right, look after yourselves, everyone. Stay safe. Enjoy. The August bank holiday, or in hope you enjoyed the August bank holiday. Enjoy the week and I'll see you soon. Cheers guys.